Coming up next on Come Again, we have in studio Jean-Luc Picard. He's going to discuss his new book, Autobiography. Stay tuned. Hey guys, welcome back to Come Again TV, the only place on YouTube where all geek culture collides. I'm Shannon, and today on the show, we're taking a look at the autobiography of Jean-Luc Picard. Uh, the story of one of Starfleet's most inspirational captains. Happy First Contact Day, everybody. I thought it fitting, with it being First Contact Day, April 5th, that we'd review the autobiography of Captain Jean-Luc Picard. Uh, this is a great book. Um, I really enjoyed it. It's got some uh, photos in here from his time as a kid, his time with Jack Crusher, uh, early on in his career on, in Starfleet, uh, TNG, the Star, uh, Stargazer, Mark Twain. Uh, his time as a Borg, and his wedding invitation to Beverly. Uh, this takes place all throughout his life. Uh, it starts off with himself as a child, and then it goes up uh, to his time through Starfleet, and his time as captain, serving as captain for 20 years aboard, aboard the Stargazer. Uh, it follows exactly what happened during Jack Crusher's death, uh, his time on the Enterprise, and then his time after the Enterprise, when he became the ambassador, the Starfleet ambassador to Vulcan. Uh, it also describes how he was let go from that uh, position and what he did after that. It really combines well with all the other media, uh, along with uh, Star Trek Countdown. Um, which counted down to the uh, Kelvin verse. Uh, it shows what his role in the destruction of Romulus was. Uh, just a great book. I really loved hearing it in um, Jean Luc's words. Uh, now, this was, it says it's edited by David A. Goodman, but we all know he actually wrote it as Jean Luc Picard. Uh, he really captures the character of Jean Luc very well. It reads almost as if Patrick Stewart is actually doing all the uh, vocabulary and everything. So it's very well done. I really enjoyed it. I highly recommend it. Um, like I said, it stays true to everything that's canon. Uh, Battle of Wolf uh, 457, I believe it was. Um, uh, it also stays true to... It finally explains how... He and Guinan met for the very first time. Uh, I know that was kind of uh, kind of seen in Next Generation whenever he and the away team went back in time, and Guinan met him for the first time. But he actually met Guinan for the first time during his captaincy of the Stargazer. Uh, actually, no, is uh, during his. Uh, he was not captain of the Stargazer at the time. He was actually, I believe, a lieutenant, perhaps. Um, it was early in his career. His captain would send him on several missions. Um, then the captain was killed, and he got promoted. And the new captain had sent him to meet Guinan, who was married to his former captain, to uh, give her some of all of his belongings and everything. So, very well done. I really enjoy it. If you have a chance, pick it up. Uh, this was actually... I picked it up at Barnes & Noble. Uh, it was about $15. So, uh, again, I really enjoyed it. Uh, take a chance on it. I promise you won't be disappointed. Have a happy first contact day, everyone. Take care. If you enjoyed that video, make sure you hit the subscribe button right there so you can stay up to date on all things geek culture. Also... Make sure you check out one of these two playlists on the side for more videos just like the one you just watched. I'm Shannon for Comic Getting TV, the only place on YouTube where all geek culture collides. Take care, geeks.